All right, I think we are good. Get the H out of here. So now I actually want to go to the, oh, hold on. Safe house, yeah. You know what, I'm good. Fuck, man. I don't have the shit for this right now. Fuck me. Fuck. Up! Unhand me, bitch. Oh, no! I just, I just whiffed. I whiffed. Yeah, excuse me. Coming through. I'm out. Nope, nope, not. I'm not doing it. Oh my god, he's throwing axes? He's been in the axe throwing competition? Jesus Christ. Speaking of axe, I'll take that axe. Okay, but yeah, grab the axe though. Nope, yeah, I'm good. I'll, I'll figure it out later. I will figure it out later. Oh my god. Jesus Christ. Uh. All right, yeah, we're good. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. I can't get coffee right now. Everyone I talk to, big Resident Evil fan, they really don't know much about the Evil Within. Even then, I, like, I played the first game, and I don't know that much. Hey, O'Neal, how's that coffee looking, bro? You want to help me help me brew, brew a cup of that shit? Dude, it's so close. Dare I just wait it out? A, cof uh, a coffee pot recharge takes 28.5 minutes in total. So 28.5 minutes. And we got, let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 7 divided by 28 is 4 minutes per bar, roughly, is what I'm gathering. All right, dare I, dare I proceed onwards a little bit longer? Kind of thinking about it. Kind of thinking about it. Let's flip a coin for it, shall I? All right, so heads. Uh, we'll, we'll keep playing. Tails, I'll get out of here. What do you guys normally do when you flip a coin? Do you flip it on the hand or do you just do it straight? I've always done it straight my whole life, but this one time I'll flip it. It is heads. We play a little bit longer. Ugh, fine by me, fine by me. I'm liking this game. Won't play too much longer. I know I'm saving a lot, but... I just got full health. So can you really blame me? I don't know. Uh, I think I'm going to stream this entire playthrough, by the way. So if you guys want to stop in live, you can absolutely do so. If you're watching this on YouTube, link in the description. All right, let's uh, let's tap into Yolden uh, Communications, you know what I'm saying? Because there's a signal right here. Go take a look. Go take a little looky-loo. I kind of murdered a lot of these guys, so they should be out of the way, hopefully. Could use some more ammo, though. Ammo, dude, is ammo going to be scarce this whole playthrough? I hope not. Are you going to drop down? Fucking, I guess I could climb up to him. I don't want to do that. That's so wrong. Go take a look somewhere else. All right, fuck off. Oh, fuck me. Motherfucker. I just got this health back, bitch. You fucking asshole. Gave me gunpowder and depression. Right, our stamina should be a little bit better. Or maybe it recharges faster? I don't know. I feel very inclined to just sneak everywhere. Because health is very uh, fleeting. Should I have played on a lower difficulty? I don't fucking know. Very nice. A little bit more gunpowder. Very nice. There's an axe right there. Okay, things are looking up a little bit. You gotta investigate your cars, folks. Gotta investigate your cars, make sure there's no no goodies. But also be wary because you might set an alarm off and that would suck. Yeah. What about this pedo van right here? Nothing in the pedo van? Alright. 
fact that E is climb is very strange. Perturbs me. I saw something in the back of the bus. Oh, oh no, that's a horn. <laughs> oh, you almost baited me again, you son of a bitch. Ooh, 500? 500 brain jelly? Alright, so what's the optimal uh, idea of this place? Is it just, like, much like the Matrix, where, uh, yeah, what's what's the end goal here, exactly? Some of these vehicles are looking pretty tip-top, in my opinion. Like, that looks pretty nice and probably running. I would be doing my best to, uh, try to nab a vehicle. I mean, the traversal isn't that far from point to point, but, you know, I mean, you get the ramming factor of a car. You tell me? I feel that way much about the zombie apocalypse as well. Like, I, your boy would be scavenging for some credit cards, right? Debit cards, I mean, they'll, they'll get you a little somewhere, for sure. Oh! I don't like the fact that the door closed behind me. Not make me feel... Okay, we got the signal. Yeah, signal's coming from behind the wall. Some scrap, nice. I burned through a lot of scrap on those uh, upgrades. I need these drawers to actually have some shit, though. That's the thing. Hold on. Some. Supplies of every cache is overrun with those things. Shit. How am I supposed to get supplies if every cache is overrun with those things? I should do it. You're not getting out of there, shit heels. James, it's Ryan. Come in. Fuck. I locked a bunch of those things in the room underneath the auto body shop. I'm heading to the visitor center now. James, do you copy? I don't think James got a copy. I think James is fucking dead. There's a supply cache under here. Where are you? I gotta get down there. Fuck. Alright, but how though? A new signal. James, where the fuck are you? Get your ass to the visitor center. You're never gonna believe. Yeah, but I could I could get some stuff though. I feel like That's four. How much is this? That's two. I mean, let's is there three, six, and ten? Five, six, two, four. So I could just do and that, right? Our residence point has been logged. Fuck. I hope she knows. I'll play Ring Around the Rosie. You think I fucking won't? I'm actually a professional Ring Around the Rosie player. I was the best since 09. What's up, yo? Oh. Nice. It wasn't exactly a one shot. Up! Mother bitch. Oh, hold on. I need to reload. God damn. Dude, she fucked me up. She fucked me up. What do you do about that exactly? You better have a syringe in there. I'm gonna be fucking pissed. Thank God. <sighs> that doesn't seem like something that would normally that doesn't seem like how that would work typically it's usually they just have like this is like hollow right here it's not like a great like this that's that's not how it that's not how it works 
He said there's a whole bunch. I don't know if I'm going to be able to survive this, to be honest. Can I get back up? I don't think I can get back up. I think I'm just fucked. Oh, Jesus Christ. Scared the shit out of me. I don't understand. Oh, oh don't that thing at me. Ken, where are you? I've been looking for you all over the place. Shit, John. What are you doing down here? You weren't supposed to see this. I don't understand. Like, whoa, whoa, don't point that, that thing at me. We're best friends, man. Come on. I know. And that makes what I have to do even harder. Stop joking around, man. Sorry, John. But I have to do this. Mobius doesn't allow for mistakes. Mobius? What on earth is Mobius? <laughs> He's telling me that's not actually a quantum fuck ton of those things. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Alright, best case scenario... I can sneak past him. There's a password. Alright, uh, what, what would they... What would they likely have the password be? Security card. Uh, security card shows a grid of authentication codes used to access Mobius locations. Some kind of Up! Close the door! What the fuck is that? Pick it up. Explosive bolt. Uh, I don't know what I do in this situation. Ah, oh, bitch. Am I just dead? Yeah. What we're gonna do is a little double backing situation. Is some shit gonna explode if I cross this? Oh. We have an idea. Hey, what's up? I don't think that alerted everyone. Oh! You got me. Definitely got me. Dude, I feel like I just have enough ammo to scrape by. That is literally it. Alright, so this brings us over here. Okay. Use ammo. Gunpowder. Whatever the fuck that is. Nails. What is this? Uh, report 592 disposal request from Mobius Operative Number 73 Union Destination Ted Sizen. Uh, RE Incident Report at approximately 1430 Citizen Number 2 53 Union uh, Jonathan Stevens. Enter an unauthorized Mobius area and witness sensitive material. Capture and reprogramming was unfortunately not an option. Was forced to institute Zeta-5 emergency measure. Requesting disposal unit at Union Auto Repair. Grab this. Alright, here's what's... Yeah, hold on, we'll back away from that. Yep, 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 yep. yep. Some kind of cipher. Come on, bitch. Later, Luther. Fucking asshole. Oh, we still have another bolt. Hell yeah. We have a shock bolt. Not a lot of ammo. Ammo has been extremely fleeting. 
Uh, Union Security. Wait, hold on. 9676. Six. How does that make sense? I, I'm, I'm actually mad curious. So, 96... Oh, I see. Oh my, that makes that makes sense. I grade weapon parts. Nice. Uh, weapon parts. What's this? Medical kit. All right. It's likely I'm gonna have to interact with the fucking zombies. Whatever they are. Please tell me this just lets me outside. And it does! Let's go. Hey, a little brain jelly? A little brain jelly? Let's see. Hit again. A little more brain jelly? Don't mind if I do. How much is this gonna give me? It's gonna give me quite a bit of brain jelly. Alright, well. One more time for good luck. All right, uh, there's some scrap right here. I say we get to the safe house and consider uh, getting the fuck out of here. Oh, uh, this has been good so far. I've been liking this. I'm actually so far a pretty big fan. I, like I, uh, if I didn't already say, I liked the first game. It was very confusing, but I did like it. I had a pretty good time uh, with the game. All in all, I thought it was good. The plot was a little confusing, but you know, I think it kind of leaves a sense of open for interpretation. Um, and you know, the developer for Resident Evil gets uh, gets his hands on something a little bit more like he's just able to like unleash something from his mind palace, you know? Because like when you're investing in a franchise, right? When you're making a franchise as, as massive as Resident Evil, like you have so many people that will just say what is or is not Resident Evil, you know? Like, there's a very definitive, like, it's grounded in reality-ish because obviously there's zombies and stuff like that. But the things that you're capable of as a person are still very steeped in reality. Like, in this game, you get to totally play with reality and perception. And, like, at the beginning, dude, it's so eerie and so creepy in a very different way. It's very cool. Very cool indeed. Uh, let's go see if we can spend some brain jelly real quick. So in the original game, they had like uh, like these little safes on the wall here that you could actually unlock stuff and it'll give you stuff like either ammo or brain jelly or whatever it may be. But uh, they let you actually walk around uh, your kind of mind palace a little bit. Interesting, to say the least. Uh, what do I want to do, though, is the question. Melee attacks. The weapons like knives and axes do more damage. That actually could be helpful. I'm actually going to grab that. Uh, we have 2,900 left. Reduce radical sway. That's not that big a deal. Athleticism. Gives a chance to automatically avoid an attack that would have damaged you. Certain attacks cannot be evaded this way. 5k though. 3k. 4k. That sounds interesting. Yeah, recovering more health, actually. Wherever you are, whatever you do. I will be right here waiting for you. That's a slide projector. Having a slide projector would actually be pretty cool. All right, let's go back to a little reality right there. Let's go hang out with the homeboy. Let's get some coffee, hopefully. Hopefully he's made a nice cup for me. I would appreciate that, O'Neal. Be a big fan of that. O'Neal. What have you been doing this whole time? Have a little drinky drink? Yes, sir. Mm. Damn, bro, just chug. That's gotta be hot, dude. Come on. Gotta be a little warm, at least. Alright, let's get a little save and let's get the H out of here. Alright, well, that's gonna do it for our first recording session of The Evil Within 2. Uh,. It's been pretty good so far. I've actually been enjoying my time. But I do want to thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys want to see more, check out the rest of the channel. In the description, there's links to not just my channel, but my friends' channels as well. And anyways, I'll see you guys later.